I am Christian. Uh, so, did you join this mega meditation? Yes, yes, I've been here for three days. So how was it? It's been amazing. I've really enjoyed my experience. I've learned so much and uh, met some really interesting people. So is it your first time doing meditation? Uh, I've been doing meditation for about two years now, but I think I've learned more about how to deepen my meditation practice. So you were doing the same breath meditation or something like that? There are different types of meditation that I've learned through yoga and um, re uh, really my main practice is just focusing on my natural breath, um, which is what I've learned through. So are you uh, local from Raleigh or? I have lived in Boone for four years, uh, Boone, North Carolina, um, but I'm from Charlotte originally. Um, and now it is your favorite. Well, yes, I, I'm staying in Charlotte with my family, and in two weeks I'm moving to Sri Lanka. Oh, wow. So how did you find about the Mega Meditation Summit? Um, I'm friends with Adjadon, who is one of the speakers oh, who spoke okay. yesterday. He texted me um, and was like, hey, here's an event, it's free, uh, free food, and uh, you can stay with us. And I was like, oh, wow, what a perfect opportunity. So, so did you have the first time you uh, experienced a pyramid energy? Yes, definitely. It's the first time I've experienced pyramid energy. And, um, I've been interested in that sort of stuff for a long time um, because I studied anthropology in the ancient past. But now it makes sense why everybody around the world is so interested in pyramids. And um, with the pyramid on my head, I think it really deepened my meditation. Yeah. I feel like I could notice that. And well, how's the food? The food's amazing. I love the food. <laughs> Was I'm it spicy it. for you? No, 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 no. It's all good. I, I've enjoyed it. Um, I don't usually eat vegetarian, but I feel much better, I think, much cleaner uh, while I've been here eating clean food. Any plans to become vegetarian yet? Or you any plans to become vegetarian yet? Uh, I don't know. I, I, uh, We'll see. I, I'd have to learn how to like what to eat, how to cook it, and stuff like that. In my family, is not vegetarian. Or, um, they do not eat healthy. But you did feel how you when you would eat with and how clean are your body? Oh, definitely. Right? The energy levels are always high. Yes, yeah, so when I eat heavy uh, meats and, and that kind of food, I, it's very dense and it makes me tired and subdued. And I think my body is so focused on just getting it, yeah. processing it, yes. that I feel foggy and, um, yeah, and I think that's so common in America. People, many people I grew up around don't understand how much food affects your energy. So will we expect you next year? Where will this event going to be? Uh, if I can, I'll be in Sri Lanka. So oh, yes. I, don't know how if unless there's something in Sri Lanka then I probably won't. I think there are some. We have some uh, yeah? uh, groups in Sri Lanka. I would love to interact yes. with uh, the community in Sri Lanka if there's uh, I will get there. that I will get that group to you. Because I've just loved interacting with everybody there. So last words about this whole if you wanna summon up for this meditation summit. Okay. Um, it's been a beautiful experience uh, with many amazing people that make me feel like I'm a part of the community. Um, and I have learned so much in such a short amount of time that I will carry on for ever. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much. Thank Christmas. you. Thank you. So nice to meet you. Nice to meet thank you. Thank you.